Welcome back again. This is WBalls03 and this is Let's Play Metroid 2 Return of Samus Part 10. I'm on to take the Zeta Metroid. This might be a hard fight. Can't have him in the legs, I know that. Well, we're in the single digits. Nine left. The screw attack. There's an energy tank. You can't go through here. Got to drop down and you're in complete darkness. There we go. And that is the fifth energy tank. Use the space jump. I believe there's a gamma or Z up here. Oh. Looks like a looks like an alpha or Gamma. It's a gamma.
where I just was. And this is the room where it has all of the uh, guns throughout the game. I believe the ice beams and that. You'll need, just like the first Metroid, you'll need the Ice Beam at the end, but actually right at the end, you can get it again, so... Uh, this is actually the beginning. Yeah, so that room, it has all the guns. It has the wave beam, the ice beam, the plasma beam, and the, get the name, phase beam. Or spacer beam, I'm not sure. There's a Zeta through here. Yep. And the screw attack will not work on them. You can remember me using the screw attack on Ridley in the first Metroid. But these don't, the screw attack does not work against them in this game. This is a Gamma, and I'm going to take on him in part 11.